I am a medical oncologist, and uh, when uh, I accepted to attend uh, this uh, press meeting, I didn't realize how many journalists I'll be in front of. My God. <laughs> <laughs> OK, we are uh, going to speak about head and neck cancer. Uh, head and neck cancer is, by definition, uh, squamous cell carcinoma arising from uh, oral cavity, larynx, uh, and pharynx. This uh, is uh, a very devastating disease uh, and uh, is uh, about the fifth uh, um, cancer as a frequency of tumor around the world. Uh, we know that uh, the concomitant use uh, of chemotherapy and radiation improves results of this disease, uh, improving survival and probably the number of uh, cured patients. But uh, the problem of such a treatment is the toxicity. Toxicity means the uh, specific chemotherapy toxicity plus the specific radiation toxicity plus uh, the uh, negative interaction that one treatment has over the toxicity of the other treatment. So it is required a very strict cooperation between uh, the medical oncologist, uh, the radiation oncologist, and uh, the many other specialists uh, to manage this, uh, uh, this toxicity. Also, uh, mm, toxicity, uh, chemoradiation improved uh, overall survival. But further improvement are precluded by toxicity. And, uh, this, of course, uh, precludes also the possibility of further gain in survival, by this treatment at least. A um, couple of years ago, cetuximab, cetuximab is uh, a target therapy uh, similar to those uh, that Martin Picard uh, spoke before. Uh, cetuximab showed uh, to be able to improve uh, uh, results of radiation without any increase in toxicity. And this uh, is uh, very important. It was the uh, first time that a drug improved uh, uh, radiation without any uh, increase in toxicity. Well, it makes, uh, of course, uh, uh, easy to believe that this drug could be added to chemo radiation because if uh, it has no uh, uh, other toxicities, it may be added uh, uh, without the risk uh, of uh, an excess of uh, toxicity to chemo radiation. And uh, the importance uh, of uh, our trial is that uh, uh, actually over, and this is a small trial, is 45 patients. Actually, the addition of cetuximab to chemo radiation has no significant increase of toxicity, except the skin toxicity that is easy to manage. And uh, this, uh, mm, of course, opened the way to further improvements in survival by chemo radiation and target therapies. That's it. Yes, we are moving to a phase three trial, but we avoid uh, one of the drugs that we have uh, used for chemo in the chemo radiation program because of negative interaction on the skin between cetuximab and this drug that is 5-fluoruracil. Uh, 